The Egyptian national weightlifting team is here for its weekly training. It's usually very noisy. Sound of weight smashing the ground is continuous. But when Egypt's top champion Mohamed Ihab is about to break his usual limit, silence falls. Everyone here wants to give Ihab all the focus he needs as he prepares to break the world record. In his bodyweight category, this is the strongest man in Africa and soon maybe in the world. It's what he has been raised to do. I grew up opening my eyes to see my father, a champion in the sports, my brothers playing it. My father was my biggest supporter. Whenever I became lazy, he was always behind me, taking my side. He passed away during my first international championship in Syria in 2007. No one wanted to inform me during the competition. Since then, I knew that if I continue in weightlifting, I'm on my own. His father lived on, however, in Ihab's heart. Remembering him is always an inspiration to the Egyptian champ and a motivation that has moved him from ranking the 123rd to be among the top players in the world. Like many individual sports in Egypt, weightlifting is not attractive to sponsors. But unlike most athletes here, Ihab never complains about it. Hopefully with my achievements, I will be able to bring in many sponsors. My sport has an immense history. I'm already getting more media attention than most. I try to make people understand that a champion is not born overnight. A champion is an industry that takes many years to make achievements. I will make people realize that I'm the goose with a golden egg. After all, I do bring in gold medals. After snatching his bronze in the 2016, the world champion has been on a winning streak. 2017 was his best year yet. He won gold in all championships in the 77 kilograms weight category. In the world championship in the United States, he had won three gold medals in snatch, clean and jerk, and in the overall carried weight, which was 361 kilograms. Weightlifting is easy for those who dream small. Of course, it's very difficult to someone whose ambitions get bigger every day, to a man who wants to leave a legacy. There are many risks in the road. I try to learn from the experiences of my trainers. I think my experience is growing rapidly, but I believe there is no one stronger than the weights. His dream is to break the all-time world record and get the Olympics gold in Tokyo 2020. Ihab will then be more than happy to retire at 31 years. He is planning to focus on passing on his experience to the younger generations. Adel Mahroui, CGTN, Cairo.